Right, okay. Here we go, Desmond. Oh, we only had to press the button. Oh! I thought it wasn't going to open then. Thought we were screwed. And now we get to actually control where we go slightly. I'll try and aim for the helipad. We made it. All action hero Desmond. Where to next? Oh, he finds the office just like that, does he? Why the hell is that artifact there? I just, I don't know, it seems really a random place. Nice. That wasn't so bad. So. You must be Desmond. Not exactly what I expected. But I guess your kind doesn't have many options these days. Who are you? Ask your father. Now give me that. I don't think so. Look. I'm not supposed to kill you. But the boss man didn't say anything about fucking you up. So you got to the cap. Well, that's him sorted. Why do they always do that? Why do they always walk closer to you when they're holding a gun out? It's just like, please take my gun off me. Please, please disarm me and make me look like a noob. But nicely handled there, Desmond. Looks like they lured us there. So who the Whoever he was. Cross? Believe it or there not, we go. He used to be an assassin. The assassin, the way I've heard it told, but... It turned out he was a sleeper agent for Abstergo, programmed to infiltrate and destroy the organization. How did he know you were there? We could be compromised. They must have caught me snooping inside their network and sent Cross to see what we were after. If they were aware of our current location, we'd know. Though, I will say this. It doesn't bode very well for future expeditions. I've set up some cameras topside. If anyone shows up, we'll see it. I'd suggest you go see about finding a socket for that power source. Or we can return to Connor if you prefer. Oh, definitely. All the artifacts in the world won't mean a thing without the key. Yeah, I, I'd rather go back to Connor, to be honest. Um, I have no idea where this socket actually is. I've never actually tried to find it. One would assume that it'd be near the gate, but it might actually not be. No, it doesn't look like it. Anyway, whatever. Some of you can tell me. You've probably done this. I mean, God knows I've been playing this for quite a while now. You've all completed it. You know what's happened. I still haven't finished it. I just... I don't know. I don't know why I've not finished this game yet. And there's so many other games coming out very soon. I really need to get a move on. I suppose the... Ooh, you can even climb that. I didn't know. Awesome. I'm just having a bit of an explore. Um, whatever. I'm just going to go back to Connor. Whoa! My God, Desmond. That scared me. Right, yeah. Let's just jump back in the Animus. That's where all the action happens. That's where all the fun is. Could check my emails though. No, I'm not gonna do that. Good luck, Desmond. Alrighty. So we're finally gonna be back with Connor now, and we have our assassin These get up. Times. The already uneasy alliance between the crown and its subjects frays. And behind them both the Templars plot, pulling strings and moving pieces. History dictates they seek order through control. But how will they affect it here? Who supports them? And what conspiracies have they already spun? All these things I must determine. For only by knowing my enemy can I hope to stop them. Still 1773. 
at the homestead. Kana. Spare a moment. Of course. Ah, yes. The rope dart. What is it? Xingbao, or rope dart, if you prefer. One of the many plans given to us by Shao Zhong to... Wow. <sighs> Sorry. We'll have to work on this. I do like the rope dart. It's pretty fun. And hilarious. If used correctly. Ganondogo. Yes, my friend. What brings you here? Is the village all right? For now. What do you mean? What has happened? Men came, claiming we had to leave. They said that the land was being sold, and that the Confederacy had consented. We sent an envoy, but they would not listen. You must refuse! We cannot oppose the Satchum, but you're right as well. We cannot give up our home. Do you have a name? Do you know who is responsible? He's called William Johnson. Where is Johnson now? In Boston, making preparations for the sale. Sale? This is theft! Connor, take care. These men are powerful. What would you have me do? I made a promise to my people. If you insist upon this course of action, seek out Sam Adams in Boston. He'll be able to help. What have you done? When my people go to war, a hatchet is buried into a post to signify its start. When the threat is ended, the hatchet is removed. Uh, you could have used a tree. <laughs> yeah, but that wouldn't have been as dramatic, would it? Alright, so we're all kitted out now. we got new weapons available in the shops. Um, now, really, the game opens up immensely. And there's a lot of side stuff we could be doing, as well as the main plot. And I'm thinking, I do want to speak to someone actually at the harbour, so can we fast travel there? We want to talk to that peg leg dude? Yeah, peg leg mission, right. Um, but we have to... Yeah, we'll fast travel to the harbour master. Yeah, so many things are open to us now, we can really start to explore, collect things do the side missions, the homestead missions. So much to do. Yeah, sequence 6 really is when the game actually starts, in my opinion. Right, um... You know what I spent ages doing? Playing uh, checkers or drafts with this guy. Don't know why, it's just quite amusing, quite fun. Here we go, this is the guy. This is the bloke that's apparently what a bit do I mental. Owe this great honor, Captain? The letters you speak of, what are they? Oh, now you wanna know. Captain Kidd's letters, boy. He hid a great treasure somewhere and sent letters to four of his crewmen along with a strange piece of leather. If you find the men, you'll find the scallywag. It's that easy, tis. May I see them? <laughs> you might be a captain, but you're not too bright, are you? I'll barter with them. You give me some trinkets I like, and I'll give you a letter. Building my own treasure cache, see? Trinkets? Like what? Where? Use your imagination, Captain. There's interest and swag all over the frontier. Hmm. I know exactly what he's on about. The, uh, if you look on our map, we should be able to see the location of some of them. Yeah, these little things. Peg leg trinket. And if we find all these, we can exchange them for um, information, and then we can do some of the peg leg missions, which are effectively like the old, you know, Assassin Tomb missions and the lair missions and all that kind of stuff. At least I think that's basically their equivalent. Um, we could do another naval mission, you know. Chaps, I'm tempted to. Yeah, let's do another naval mission. Let's see what's available to us. We have Henderson in distress. Route risk rate. Okay. Uh, dead of night. I don't know which one to do here. Well, to be fair, we might as well do the one that's closest. 
Henderson in distress. Defend the Henderson against British privateers. Yeah, we'll do it. And what I do like about the naval missions is, uh, you'll see in a second, Connor gets a little bit of a captain outfit to wear. So, you know, he looks the part. Which is good. Alright, where are these privateers? Ooh, look at all this. Bit of action going on. Right. So we want to protect our friend there. But he's just taking down one ship. Do not shoot your allies. I'm not trying to. Oh, we should have got him then. Alright, that's one ship down. Okay. Now let's head towards the rest of the bunch. Oh, in fact, there's three over there. Sugar. damage to them there. Oh my god, the Henderson's lost all that health already. I know I'm sailing into the wind, but I've got to turn around. Oh my, I've really messed this mission up already. Oh, and I didn't duck. Down. I'm re yeah, see, I'm really quite bad at these, you know. Alright. Go. Oh, they are tough. Oh, where's my mate gone? Right, he's over there. I didn't need to fire that one then. Duck! There we go. The Henderson is really losing some health there. Right, that ship near him is, is gone. So he should be safe for a little bit. I need to turn around. Go to half sail. I should get some of them. Yeah, nicely done. Quite a decent range on these guns, you know? Didn't even realize that. Is another one down? Oh, we just missed that one. One ship left. There he is. And he's gone! So I probably could have done much better on that one. It's just the opening part where he's got like three ships quite close to him that he seems to lose a lot of health there, but that's one naval mission done. And you can always reattempt them as many times as you want. And here we go, this is the, the outfit up close and personal. Which you can actually unlock to use whenever you want in uh, the regular portion of the game, but I like it, it's pretty cool. So, I think what we'll do now is look for some homestead missions to do, and I might actually want to head back to the house to send off another convoy. Um, I will be doing a lot of the hunting off-screen just to get some supplies to sell build up some money because we're a little bit broke at the moment I think. But there's a homestead mission and um, we can talk to that guy there. Interactive conversation. I've not really been too fussed about getting those though. Um, oh lots of homestead missions to to get kicked off. We'll fast travel back to the manor. And I think we will do one of these homestead missions. Oh, so much to do. You can complete one homestead mission, then another one will pop up, and you might still already have, like, two to do, and then... Oh, so easy to get sidetracked. Right, which one should we do first? Oh, it looks like there's one actually in the house itself. Oh, it's Achilles. Okay. Encyclopedia of the Common Man. 